Hey guys, Ricardo here, and Ricardo here, and welcome to another blog tech tips. Of course, in today's tutorial, guys, I'll show you how to fix the issue where your iMessage is not working after the iOS 14 update. And of course, as you can see here, guys, I'm on iOS 14, which is the latest version of iOS. And in case you're having problems where as soon as you try to use your iMessages, when you go in, of course, it's not working. All right, so if your iMessages are not working, do the following to fix the issue and of course you should fix it and it should work start working again all right so let's get straight into it now one of the first things you want to try guys after doing um, the ios 14 update or if ims is not working is to go ahead and reboot your device um it sounds simple as always however it is one of the first things you should try to rule out the possibility that that's what's causing you or the feature from working so let's go ahead guys you're gonna um, trigger the um, phone to power off. So that's your um, sleep weight button plus volume down. You're gonna slide the power off, all right? All right, so of course, guys, after doing all of this, what you're gonna do next is you're going to just do the reboot. And when you come back, guys, you should be good. So I'm gonna close this out and just show you as good as you reboot. All right, guys, so one of the next thing you wanna do um, after this is to simply go ahead and once you go ahead guys and you have rebooted go ahead and try iMessages again after doing that it should in most cases fix iMessages if that didn't work guys sometimes it's a communication issue with your network so make sure that your um, internet settings is in place make sure it's browsing so you can try other things such as browsing normally and to ensure that you do have an active data connection and of course sometimes again what can help is to place your device in airplane mode there's airplane mode so go ahead and um, hit the airplane mode and you'll be know you're in airplane mode as there'll be the symbol of an airplane on the upper right um, once in this mode all communications have been cut to the device and what's gonna happen is as soon as you come out of airplane mode your device will have to reconnect to your network which can fix communication problems when you connect to your network afresh so as you can see here guys wait at least um 60 seconds you might want to give it two minutes or just allow it to settle a little bit in the mode after a minute or two go ahead and turn off the mode notice it says searching as soon as i reconnect it notice now i'm um, notified that i have some form of voicemail and so on that indicates it has connected to the network you know you won't necessarily see that However, once you reconnect, go ahead and try iMessages again. Um, if that doesn't work, guys, the next thing you can do is to just go ahead and check check your um, basic settings for iMessages. So once you're in here, you're going to go ahead and you're going to search for the Messages app. Here you go. Once you tap, notice in here you should have a bunch of settings. Uh, make sure iMessages is on. If it's off, what's going to happen is that it's not going to work. It's going to send regular texts. Um, of course, make sure it's on. If it's on, make sure you have either an email or a phone number associated. In other words, if there is nothing here, go ahead and tap. Go ahead and choose either your associated email or your number based on your provider. If you're not sure and you're seeing both email and number, go ahead and try both. I would advise you to try your um, number first, then your email. It should say registering. And then, of course, you should see where it's connected and it shows you a number or email to which it's used as your um, sending and receiving center. All right. Um, it should indicate that iMessage can be sent between iPhones, iPads, and so on once it's connected and everything is okay. It should show everything right here. Now, once you have set up all of that, um, you should be good. Also, be reminded that some network providers might charge for the reactivation. All right. So, this is common, especially after either. Um, removing your sim card or doing something network based sometimes you can be kicked off the um, network for sending iMessages. messages but as soon as you make that correction and um, re-register you should be good as i said if your um, carrier uses credits it might take off some of your um, credit the next thing to try guys which i've always found to work is to go into settings once you're in settings guys you're gonna go down to general and of course you're gonna go to reset and of course, after every reset, sometimes you have all kind of issues that's network based. It's always a good idea to reset network settings, which is this mid one here. You simply tap, follow the on-screen instructions, and you're going to restart your um, network settings. You'll be required to re-input your um, information, such as your passwords for Wi-Fi, your information for Wi-Fi, and so on, which is normal. All you did was to reset your network settings. You can have... Um, 
bad settings being transferred or from a, a later version which can affect the functionality of your device including stuff such as communications and of course stuff like iMessages after doing that guys you should be good again if all of that fails guys the last thing you can try is to go to settings this time from in the main settings menu you're going to go down to um, general again software update and you're going to check for software updates now of course please remember that you need internet connection i'm not really connected to the internet right now let me just connect right so um your device will check for um uh update if it says no update is available you'll have to keep checking until you get an update um what happens is that apple keep will keep rolling out updates and of course they can fix various issues such as um, um iMessage problems and so on and various bugs so of course you'll be at the mercy at apple until that is fixed um of course you can also look into resetting your device that should be our last resort as you'll have to back up your device before attempting that and of course nobody really wants to do that but of course in some cases it can be the only solutions if you think that won't work you might have to try the opposite of that which is a downgrade which means you'll have to downgrade your software back to ios 13 from 14 and then of course wait a long while a year or so or maybe six months or until you're satisfied that there is it's stable enough to update in which your book will be fixed all right so i've covered all of the things that you can do um some of those are out of your hands such as the stuff that you'll have to wait on apple to do but of course if you do all of those you should be good as always guys ricardo gardner from block tech tips showing you how to tackle the issue where iMessages is not working on your device after ios 14 update all right guys ricardo gardner from block tech tips and bye until next time bye guys love you